Today we're going to be doing an experiment with sodium metal. We're just going to burn it in air. I've never seen it burned in air before. Um, oh, quick update. That's happening. But uh, we're just going to take this, you know, burn it in air. I would put it in water, but that experiment has been done so many times on YouTube, there's no point. You can just look it up. And you'll probably find someone throwing in a two-pound chunk. And I only have, it says 10 grams, but I've used a lot of it. So uh, let's just, just start the experiment. All right, I just wanted to show you something really interesting about sodium. It's so soft that you can cut it with a butter knife. And this is just a plastic butter knife. So uh, I'm actually cutting that with this plastic butter knife. It's really, really soft. And uh, you can see there, if I can get this open, uh, the sodium is actually very shiny. But uh, the reason that it doesn't really look that shiny on the outside is because it's so reactive that it quickly oxidizes with the air. I've got the sodium metal right here, and uh, this might actually react with the concrete. I know lithium does react with concrete, so uh, there is a possibility that this sodium metal right here will actually react and make some pretty sparks. Alright, so there's the sodium burning, and uh, it's definitely different from what I expected. I thought it was going to pop because of the... Um, the concrete, but as you can see there, it's just a really bright yellow flame. That's really interesting. That's sodium vapor. Uh, that's really bad to breathe in. Wow, that is smoking so much. It's definitely very similar to the, um, the sodium chloride and lithium reaction because the, the sodium is just burning away very slowly. And, uh, alright, it looks like the reaction is over there. And, uh, there's, what is that? There's a weird liquid right there. I don't know what that is. I'll have to figure that out. Oh, maybe it's, a. Uh, Oh, I think that's uh, molten sodium hydroxide. So uh, that's very dangerous. If I touch that, uh, it would probably just instantly <laughs> melt through my skin. That was a pretty cool reaction. All right, see you later.